What's up guys, Kenny G here coming at you with another video. Today we're going to be talking about how to load ISO files onto your PlayStation 2 hard drive after you've prepared it for use with free McBoot in OPL using the process I showed in the previous video. So I'm going to attach a link to that previous video in case you haven't seen it already, but essentially you just need to format the drive to be PlayStation 2 format. Now we use a program called WinHip to do that and it's very... Uh, well outlined how to do that in the previous video, so I will link it. Now, let's get started with the process here. While there are multiple ways to do this, the way I'm showing in this video is to actually attach the hard drive to your computer. There are multiple ways to do that. You can hook it directly into your computer by opening the case and plugging it into one of the cables inside, or you can purchase an adapter that's gonna connect to the back of the hard drive, providing it power and the data connection, and it's gonna go into like a USB connection that's gonna you know pop into one of the slots on the back of your computer either way is fine either way will work it's just what you have available obviously the usb uh, adapter is the quicker easier solution than opening up your computer let's get started with the process it's actually quite simple we're going to jump back into the same folder we were we were in last time and we're going to go into the winhip folder and we're just going to run winhip in administrator mode again now just click ok now we're gonna select our hard drive. Once the prompt comes up, just select your PS2 hard drive from the list. Then we're gonna go down and click add image files. You can also uh, copy files from like uh, disks, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna click add image. Then we're just gonna navigate to our folder. We have the ISO files for PS2 games stored in. So wherever you've got them, I'm just navigating to where I have them. Uh, which is actually in my PS2 Samba share, which I also show how to do that if you're interested in how to load files over like a network share. Anyways, this is loading the images pr pretty straightforward. So I'm going to fast forward this and we'll come back at the other end of the video. Okay, guys, it really is that simple. Just load up WinHip, click add images, add the ISO files that you want to add to your PS2 hard drive, add them, let the process finish, and then reinstall your PS2 hard drive back into obviously the ps2 right anyways that's really all there is to say for the time being i hope this tutorial was helpful for you guys if you found it helpful please consider pushing like that would mean a lot to me if you want to help support the channel if you like what we're doing here we've got lots of other tutorials on here as well to do with the wii u the ps4 and even the Nintendo Switch, we've got a whole whack of tutorials. So if you want to help us out on our climb to 1,000 subscribers, a subscription will be greatly appreciated. Either way, guys, thanks for watching, and I hope you have a great day. Hey, guys, this is Lydia. If you like what you see, hit that like button, as it helps our channel gain exposure. Also, consider smashing subscribe. If you like our content, it would really mean a lot and helps our channel grow. If you want to interact with us, leave a comment down below. Or follow us on Twitch at super underscore dorkalicious. We'll see you next time.